All right, so this is Brett Douglas, something really weird, but that's what I do on my channel. This is Allie, and I'm meeting her for the first time, and she's doing a surprise reaction. She did not know that she was going to be doing this. Well, no, she knew she was going to be doing a reaction, but, like, listen to how awkward and scared I am, you know? Just do it with something for the first time. So, shout out to Allie, uh, just an amazing person. But check her out, guys. She's a... He will like me, I call her an expert, but she is amazing and very knowledgeable. Okay. All right. Hi, Allie. I'm Brett. How you doing? Hi. I'm doing great. How are you? Um, I'm very good. I'm uh, okay. I'm happy because you said that you play the guitar and you do the ukulele, right? Yes, sir. Can you show it one more time? Oh, okay. <laughs> Hold on. My oh. lovely baritone ukulele. Can you strum it once? <laughs> I want to hear it a little. Oh, it's very out of tune, I'm sure. Oh, it's still, it's amazing. Yeah, so it's like, it's like a guitar. A typical ukulele is tuned entirely different, but yeah. So maybe I'll play something for you sometime. I would, I would absolutely love that. <laughs> um, I, res I respect people so much that play an instrument. Um, I make music and... I just do, I just like pick out beats, like, you yeah. know, I mean, it's still art, but. Oh, know, absolutely. I, I always get the jealous of people that. Ooh, so is, this a, oh, is that what we're watching or? Um, I have, okay. So I, I got, um, we got like 10,000 views, which is really uh, good for me. And. Oh, really? Know, that rocks. Yeah. Yesterday. And. It was because I brought this guy on who plays guitar, and we reacted to someone who plays a guitar. Oh, that's actually so cool! And so, oh, I gotta put my hat on. All right, so this is the, so I got really surprised that you play an instrument because, you know, I can't react to this guy. And I, you know, and be and because I, I don't know, like I'm not like an expert, so. right? I'm not going to pretend like I'm an expert. I mean, I've done that before. So uh -huh. this is called, a guy called Elite Vata. Uh, ooh. And it already looks really cool. I like the guitar. I typically, love, typically I'm more of a fan of like, kind of like the texture designs, like on mine. You can like, you can see the lines of the wood. His is more of a plain color, but I do still like it. This guy is so popular right now in uh, the country. I He's in. <laughs> That's real good information. Okay. Um, all right, I'm to, I'm gonna share my audio. This is kind of a surprise okay. to her. Um, I feel bad, but no, no, no it's okay. Uh, what do I do? Oh, all right, I'm gonna share my sound. <laughs> so this is like a surprise reaction. Do you know Angelina Jordan? Uh, no. Oh my god. Unfortunately, gosh. sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. You that that means it would be a first time reaction. It I, is. Here we go. All right. So I enjoy I, I enjoy listening to people uh, that know what they're talking about <laughs> talk about <laughs> this. It has um, been a couple of years since I've actually played a guitar, but I play ukulele all the time. So. But you know if he's like good, right? Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay, so. I can get feedback. I just wouldn't take it to like an expert and say this is like it because <laughs> I wouldn't put all the eggs in my basket you know so you're a young person how old are you I'm 19 <laughs> so you're, you're 19 yep but you like you give me some hope for the youth because like you have all these like great hobbies and stuff like yeah it sounds so old but uh that's okay so if you just uh start talking I will pause it okay um, but you know, just just have fun. This is like the, I think this is the might be the first surprise reaction uh, of, of, of internet history. So no oh pressure, gosh, okay. no, no pressure worries. at all. No worries. And okay. we just met, so this is a uh, this is a fun channel. Here we go. Okay. Ooh. Can you full screen it?
You said you're frozen? It was. Hold on. Wait. Unpause it. Okay. Oh, it's good. Okay. That's impressive. So, like, why is it impressive? Because I really don't know. I know it's impressive, but, like... See, one of my biggest things is just, like... I, I hate saying this, because it's, like... It, it's a it's a risky word. It's like when fingering stuff. It, no, it's okay. It's it's, it's very difficult um, to like. I don't know. Sorry, I'm a little nervous. I suppose it's a surprise reaction. It's it of is. Course. It is. I'm a little put on the spot here. Um. <laughs> see, I have a lot of trouble, especially because it seems like his fingernails are really long. And I that's very, very strange observation. But for me, if my fingernails are like even slightly long, I cannot play. That's why I like I only ever I never do like acrylics. I never grow my nails out or anything like that because I have a lot of trouble playing when my nails are even slightest bit long. And so I guess he can use it to help him with the finger picking and making like, you know, like stronger, stronger sounds and things like that. But for me, it I find it so hard to play like that. So I don't think anyone's ever said that before. That's freaking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But he knows what he's doing. Our he, he, he does know what he's more. doing. Um I also love that he has the blue capo. That that one's I don't know. It just kind of sticks out to me. Wait, what's he got? The the capo. Um it's a thing he's got up here. Oh the blue yeah. thing. Yeah, the blue thing. Uh <laughs> it basically brings it up a key. So uh, instead of having to like you know like hold that down the entire time and like play along with it, he can uh, he can just clip that on and it holds down all the strings so it goes up the key. Here, I can actually show you. So like if I have no capo, and then if I put the capo on, let's just say third fret. See, it sounds so much higher. Ooh, wow. Yeah. So like the higher you put it up. So basically just makes it a lot easier to play a certain key of music. So I love yeah. that. Another thing I, I've never heard anyone like say, like is <laughs> I, I've had a couple, I've had like three guitarists on this channel to, you know, break down this stuff. And oh. um that, <laughs> please do not compare me to them. Like I said, it's been no, years, like, it's, okay. <laughs> it's like you just uh like we're just two friends chilling and you're just making observations. Okay. All right. You guys seem very, very talented, though. Um, just I love the way it sounds already. It's a lot of depth to it. Alip Pata. I gotta put my Alip Pata hat on. <laughs> but can you see me right now? Because I, I, in my, I, uh, I can my, see you. I only see you, so I think oh. that that's what uh, is going to be on video. Oh. Interesting. But I have no idea. I have no idea what's going to happen. I'm not very happy with me, so. That's okay. No worries. I'll put my hat on and push play. Okay. <laughs> Is it clean? It just sounds so clean. I love. I think. It, I think it's definitely sounds really, really nice because he's got the he's got the mic like in it, like right there. It just. I don't know. It just sounds so clean. Um, sometimes when uh, playing your guitar, it can sound kind of like. I don't know how to describe it. It like kind of like brazzy, like the. You'll have the weird like undertone sound. Not for him. Like I don't know how to how to like. It's hard to, yeah, it's hard to, like, imitate it. Um, like, it'll playing, have that, like, like the kinda, singing like, part, too. Like, it'll have, playing. like, the buzzing, you know? And his doesn't really buzz very much. It's just very nice. I really like it. You think it's a really nice guitar? Yeah. Uh, he's probably got some pretty good strings on there, too. Um, but, yeah. But he's, uh, he's, like, he's doing, like, the singing part right now. Um, but yeah. so sometimes he switches to the... Like, would instrumental? You call yeah, there you go. 
So, okay, I'm gonna hit play. Okay. I see I'm what just, the okay. nails. <laughs> yeah. They're, they're, they're long. Mine, I'm not going to show them because they're a bit embarrassing. <laughs> I keep them so short. They're, what, are mine okay? Wait. I, see, I... Your I camera's... I yeah. I have a broken computer and uh, I don't know why I'm doing that anyway. <laughs> but uh, so I'm looking at you on there, and, but I should be looking oh, this way. Yeah. But I have a new one on the way. Your camera. Uh... Yeah, they're kind of short. It's kind of what mine look like. Oh, geez. <laughs> well, maybe not exactly like that, but you know. I have small hands, too, though. That's also why I prefer ukulele. Yeah, what is the other What is the other uh, title for a ukulele? Some people say that it's the same instrument as something, but then some people say it's not the same instrument as something. Ukulele. I'm talking about a bass? No, oh, okay. it's, it's like a country thing. Oh, you mean a fucking banjo? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> maybe. I don't think so. I don't, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't, I don't Hold know on, that I'm googling this real quick. Right. Banjo. I feel like banjos have. What's a other word for ukulele? Siri. Other <laughs> word for. I, I keep looking the wrong way. Um, small guitar, cavacolele. No, I don't know. It, I don't know either. I mean, people just say uke for sure, but I don't think that's what you're referencing. I don't know what I'm referencing. I might be referencing an entire different. You might be thinking of a banjo. You know, I like. I think I am. Because a banjo is kind of like it's like a long ukulele, but it's like round. And then I think it's the either. I think it's the four strings. I never say that. Listen, I never say. Do you know Grace Vanderwall? I do. I do. Really? I so I I love her. Um, her fans and me have had kind of a falling out. <laughs> it's all good. I I, I don't know. Uh, it's all good. Kind of they falling got, out. Yeah, they got they, drama. Well, they got mad at me because I. I said I, th that clearly now was not like one of my favorite Grace songs, and I would rather hear a bunch of the other songs. Wait, which was not your favorite? Uh, clearly now, I can see. Oh, clearly now. I actually, I think I've only heard two of her songs after the uh, "I don't know my I don't know my name." Yeah, that one. So that's what got me into America's Got Talent, and oh now, yeah, I'm like friends with producers and stuff like. I'm hey, friends with the thanks. people that are on the show. <laughs> um, I knew that, uh, that, like, I get, like, secret information that I don't tell people, like, uh, when Broken Roots were coming back as a wild card. Because they don't get, they can trust me. Because if I would have been like, so I got the deets on who's coming back as the wild card, they wouldn't have brought him back. They would have brought another surprise. I would have yeah. ruined their entire thing. It did feel good to have that kind of power. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, I'm, we were going to get back to the uh, thing. It might right. be a banjo, though. It might be a banjo. Probably. I'm going to ask my mentor because, oh, wait, wait. It's a violin and something else, I think. A viola? No, a violin and what else is it? Maybe a violin and a ukulele. I don't know what the heck I'm talking about. That's okay. No worries. You go. A cello? Yeah. yeah. Should we, wait, no. <laughs> I'm going to ask my mentor. I'm just thinking of four string instruments, although I don't know if a cello is four string. <laughs> wait, so a guitar is five or six? A guitar is six. You can see it if you count. So I'm the host of the show. I don't I do not do any of the... Uh, my my uh, specialty is original songs and uh, mm -hmm. song structure and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Like I, I write songs for other people. You know, because I'm That's not a good cool. singer. I I am a singer. Yeah. Oh, we gotta hear you sing too. <laughs> maybe you, some other time. No, I know you're. Maybe you should go on America's Got Talent. 
I, as a child, well, not a child, as like, you know, young teen, um, when like America's Got Talent was like skyrocketing, everybody kept telling me to. And I was like, ah, maybe. And then I never did. <laughs> hey, it's never too late. I have written 73 songs and not released any of them. Are you serious? <laughs> I don't really? I don't have a producer. I'm not I'm not as tech savvy when it comes to my music stuff. I have written so many songs that I think are just fantastic and I mean I have the cool mic. I mean Oh my I, gosh, what kind is that? <laughs> oh, this is a five fine. It's uh my settings are all wacky, so it may not sound that good right now, but it is a good mic. Um if I just, you know, set it up the right way. <laughs> and like I, I don't know, and I have um, this, my ukulele is actually a uh, an acoustic electric, so it does plug into my computer, so I can record stuff, I just, I don't know how to produce anything, and it's just so yeah. difficult, because it's not like I can just, you know, play it and then just send it out, I, there's got to be a lot of technical stuff to it, and I just, I can't do that, so. Well, we, uh, we just need to get some, like, investors, sponsors, uh, <laughs> what you need is a great engineer. And um, also, you should put out like, you know, like a YouTube. Uh, so you've written seventy three songs, or you've like yeah. produced and put together seventy three songs. I've written. I've not produced any. Oh my gosh! Are you serious? Yeah. All right, we're gonna help her do that, guys. <laughs> we're gonna help her do that. There's actually this one song I wrote like a year ago that's just been like popping back into my head because it's it was when I really, really, really wanted to release. It's called Hallmark Movie. You want to that what you want to show us a little oh no <laughs> okay all right that's a great name for a song um it's it's essentially about like how i crave you know the typical rom-com you know cheesy romance that are in that's in a ha like a hallmark movie and i don't really get that you know it it, it sounds much cooler when you know it's an actual song i, I might send you a clip of it it's a I great idea, though. On, I used to go live on TikTok and sing it, and I have a clip from it, so I'll send that to you. Awesome. Don't post well, it though. No, no, no. I, okay. I'm not. A, I'm not the kind of guy that posts stuff. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I, you know, I never your stuff. Like, I'll yes, post okay. some. Of my, I'll post my stuff that's like not ready for the big time. There's just, you know, just for me. Yeah. difficult chords really yeah see that's probably one of the biggest reasons i like ukulele is because it's smaller it's really hard to like because i do have small hands it's really hard to like stretch them out that much and he's doing some like wide chords he's got to have his like every single one of his fingers on different frets it's difficult what's that clicking sound that it's kind of cool it's like he's going I oh, um, he might just be hammering. Hammering. Like, sometimes when you, there's a couple different ways you can do it. You can just kind of like click it. Like, I don't know. It's hard to explain. You can either just like click it on it or there's a way like you can play where you can just kind of like, I don't know how to describe like, it's like, okay. you can see like you just kind of like, you can just kind of hit it, hit the strings, which makes that sound. There's a couple different ways you can like make the kind of clicking hammer just kind of solid sounds it, it kind of helps you like be your percussion as well as the acoustic it's interesting you're very smart <laughs> okay <laughs> i'm serious like you're very very smart i try thank you and I, the flattery is real today well yeah i i mean i just i respect uh you know artists so much you know. Thank you. I can't stop staring at his nails now. You did that. I'm sorry. That's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna be honest, I don't 
don't actually like Bohemian Rhapsody, the song. I might get so much hate for that. But oh my I, gosh. I, I strongly dislike that song. That's awesome. That's yeah. awesome. That's so awesome. I feel yeah. I feel bad because I know I'm going against the norm. Everyone's like, oh my gosh, what do we rap city? And, and they always sing it. And like obviously I know the lyrics and I've listened to it plenty of times. And if anyone plays it, I will listen and I will sing along. However, I just don't like the composition of it. I don't like I don't like when songs constantly change, you know, throughout it. Yeah. Uh, obviously, I know some people they do very much enjoy that, and that gives like a sense of mystery. But I, I, uh, I like consistency. That may just be me, though. Um, I never really thought about it. I, I don't like love it or anything. Yeah. You know? Have you heard Angelina Jordan's version? I have not. So I like that version much better. Um, okay. So, but this this guy is like awesome at what he does. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Okay. I'm going to show you.